Good night, YouTube. Good night. It's your boy Lazy back again with another video. Hey, you see how bright this shit is in my car? I just done put some new, um, some new LED lights in my in my shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm right now where I'm currently working on my vehicle. I just got my shit up at the shop probably like four days ago. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just, and I'm working on my shit, man. Please, 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 please. Now I can really shoot videos in this bitch. Yeah, I could really. Uh, you can see the diamonds and diamonds. It's straight. But um, listen, man, I'm I'm speaking with Soul Ties, man. This this shit is about Soul Ties. I had definitely made a video, but for some reason it got taken down. I had seen somebody like comment on another video. Nah, you wasn't tripping. It just, I don't know. It was just, they don't want this type of shit out there. But um, Listen, Soul Ties is very, is like very, very powerful. Though, so this is why, like, you can't be having sex with anybody, man. Cause like, once you have, once you start having sex with a particular person, you, it's, bro. It, yeah, it feels good on a physical level, but spiritually, you bonding yourself with this person. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, for instance, me, like. I was dealing with a female, you feel me? She done moved out of state. And she was only out of state for like four months, three months. And, um, you know, I respect the honesty of her or whatever. She told me she, you know, had sex with a particular dude. I don't know, dude, you feel me? And um, she's telling me dude's crazy. Whoop -de -whoop. And, um, you know, um, if dude's crazy, you let him get up in you. Y'all done became one flesh, so you're going to be... She's already crazy, so you're going to be extra crazy. You know what I'm saying? And it's like... And for that particular female, I know you be watching my videos. Listen, I'm not dissing you. I'm just being honest, bro. You know what I'm saying? You very um emotional. So it's like... If, if dude is very emotional and you're emotional, y'all going to be like four times emotional. That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? You don't match your match. You know what I'm saying? But, um, so this is why, like, you got to be careful because you're going to pick on the traits of somebody else. See, me, I've been celibate for four months. You know what I'm saying? Let's stay from July. July, August, September, October, November. Matter of fact, five months I've been celibate. You know what I'm saying? So since I'm being celibate, that means I'm, 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 I'm working on cutting soul ties. So the particular female I was dealing with, I had soul ties with her because I was dealing with her for two years. Two years. Having sex, bruh. You feel me? First time, couple of times, I don't I don't fuck uh, I don't fucked her with a condom. You know what I'm saying? After that, I'm fucking raw. Fucking raw than a bitch. Pussy with gooder than a bitch. Orgasms. Yes. All that. If if you from fucking Florida, you know about rappers water part. That's how it was, fam. You know what I'm saying? Great pussy. Motherfucker was crazy, though. Spiritual. But I mean, I felt like I put that spiritual shit on her, though. You know what I'm saying? She knew some shit, but I, you know, I was some add-ons. I was some perks. You get what I'm saying? But soul ties is real. And, you know, when you, you know, you, when you really, you know, fucking somebody, especially if you just really fucking one person, you're going to be thinking about that person. You know what I'm saying? They're going to be thinking about you. But when you fucking multiple people, you're going to be thinking that you're going to be thinking about this person at one particular time. You're going to be thinking about this person one particular time and that particular time. You know what I'm saying? So this is why, like, being celibate is a great thing to kill the attachments, bro. See, I'm celibate. I'm working on that shit, bro. I've been celibate for five fucking months, bro. I'm still thinking about, like, certain shit. Me and this female done dead. You know what I'm saying? Not even just sexual, bro. You know what I'm saying? The conversations, deep intellectual conversations we had. And, bro, this shit is not no easy journey. Now, some would say, like, I mean, if you celibate and you don't see me, semen retention and celibacy is about the same shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I, you can relapse on semen retention. How the fuck you can relapse on, um, you know, celibacy, you feel me? Because you, if you're not putting your energy into somebody, you know what I'm saying? But I'm guessing if you relapse on semen retention because you're playing by yourself, you're still releasing your energy into 
an entity that you don't see. So it's basically about the same shit. So if you celebrate, if you go and celebrate, you might as well just stay on similar intention and don't even like play with yourself or whatever. Woo -woo. No disrespect, but um, it's a lot of spiritual benefits, you know, while you're on, while you being celibate. Like when I was celibate, like. When you be doing this type of, when you doing these type of practices, bro, these demons are coming, bro. I'm telling you, bro, they're coming. Jazabels are coming, like right now, bro. I'm celibate, and it's like them bitches know I ain't getting, I ain't, I, I ain't had no pussy. They're like, I'm trying to, I'm talking about my job, fam. Like, and you have a, a more clearer mind and shit. You know what I'm saying? But it's like you just gotta be careful. Around this time, bro, because a lot of people are having sex, bro, during the holidays. Right now, people are getting drunk. Thanksgiving coming up. They put people up, pulling up with their boyfriend and girlfriend that they just met in, in three weeks. Sweat ain't love. Nah, y'all not in love, bro. Y'all in lust. The reason why y'all in lust because y'all been fucking raw for, for, for like, a week and a half and y'all y'all already saying i love each other in three weeks you know what i'm saying shit like that and then christmas gonna come up we're gonna be spending all their money on them on no motherfucker they don't know you know but that's just what it is fam it is what it is so if you're really trying to get over somebody go celibate go celibate you know what i'm saying because it's gonna it's, it's, it's gonna help you break them soul ties you know what i'm saying be, and then you're going to have a more clarity of mindset. And then plus, you'll be able to manifest things quicker in the physical. You know what I'm saying? And God will God will be giving you downloads quicker, fam. Like, y'all, I'm just, I'm just letting y'all know, man. If you ain't fucking nobody right now, bro, that's an A+. Because right now, bro, I'm from Florida, fam. These niggas... South Florida exact too, bro. It's these niggas. This is why you can't be fucking all the time, bro. You gotta have dick control. These niggas down here was fucking a tranny called Hennessy, bro. You know what I'm saying? Something is wrong with them boys' spirit, fam. Them boys fuck the man. I don't give a fuck. Them boys fuck the man and got exposed by that shit. They will never be the same, fam. Never. And them niggas know they fucked the man. Because they got exposed. The training said I was a man. I would have killed myself, fam. You're gay. You can't come back from that. I don't give a fuck how many bad bitches you fucked after that, fam. You know what I'm saying? And then these the niggas who's fucking all the females... Putting that, that, that other spirit into them, that gay spirit into them, into these females. And these females, and these females, they sucking dick, they fuck, and this, and this is gonna keep spreading. Bro, y'all need, y'all, I'm telling you, bro, if you're not celibate around this time, bro, because we living in some treacherous times, sex is just not physical, bro. It is just not physical. You know what I'm saying? I be ahead of things, and I'm gonna stay ahead of things, you know? But um, soul ties is real. If you really want to cut them soul ties off, I'm just going to give you a brief ending statement. Go celibate. Eight months, nine months, ten months, eleven months. I've been celibate for five months. I'm still thinking about this motherfucking female that I've been dealing with for two years. Dangerous. But I learn, I'm, learn, I learn, I'm learning from the situation. You know what I'm saying? Because when I first met this female, I was not trying to fuck nothing the females to the point to the point the female was saying i'm gay i was on semen retention bro i was like on 60 days when i met this female i ain't want to tell the female i'm on semen retention they're gonna be like you fucking weird and then one motherfucking day i'm a man she a female she ain't no ugly ass female shit just happened you know what i'm saying that's what the baba said it, it is not good for a man to touch a female, bro. I be at work. I'm seeing females hugging dudes. and Man, that nigga getting on hard while he, why you hugging him. Real shit, man. The Bible, the, the Bible is the realest book out here, fam. 
You know what I'm saying? But you want to break them attachments, them soul ties. You want a peace of mind. You want clarity. Go celibate. Drop them comments. Like, subscribe. Deuces.